What's up, guys? It's Double Nix, and today we're going to be talking about ticker symbol VRVR. Again, ticker symbol VRVR, also known as Virtual Interactive Technologies Corp. This stock is a pink current stock, transfer agent verified. This stock actually came up on my radar a couple days ago. And there was some news that I noticed about it that is going to be very, very interesting to all of you guys. Now, before I get into it, let's go over what this company does. Virtual Interactive Technologies Corp. acquitted Advanced Interactive Gaming in September 2019, which remains a wholly owned subsidiary and is the operating entity for VIT, which is Virtual Interactive Technologies. VIT finances the development of video game projects to be released on various popular gaming platforms in exchange for a royalty stream on the games. To date, the company financed several gaming titles, including Carmageddon Max Damage, Carmageddon Crashers, Interplanetary Enhanced Edition, Catch and Release, and Warbital. Collectively, these games are distributed worldwide on various gaming platforms, including the Sony PlayStation, Xbox, Steam, which is on PC, and Oculus, among others. In addition to financing solutions, VIT offers expertise in development solutions, publishing and marketing video game products, and is actively involved in the early stages of VR slash AR game development. VIT continues to reinvest its royalty income into growing its royalty contracts and intellectual property in the video game development industry. Now let's go into the float. Now as you can see here, it says that the float is not available, so I'm going to actually look at the unrestricted outstanding shares, which was actually updated quite recently on the 7th of January. The unrestricted shares are 4,692,633, which is a very, very low float. Now again, unrestricted shares is very close to what the actual float is. So even if I could highball it and say it's 5 million, that's still a pretty low float. So every day I tend to look through SEC documents and see if I could find any news on certain stocks. And I came across this little gem right here. On December 1st, 2021, the company, VRVR, entered into an agreement with a production entity for the services of Dwayne Dog Chapman, also known as Dog the Bounty Hunter. Pursued to the agreement, the company and Mr. Chapman will develop a market line of video games in cooperation with the other and will use Mr. Chapman's name, image, and likeness in connection with the advertisement promotion and sale of video games. For those of you who don't know who Dog the Bounty Hunter is, I'm going to give you a brief description. I'm not going to go too into it. Dog the Bounty Hunter is an American reality TV series which aired on A&E and chronicled Dwayne Dog Chapman's experiences as a bounty hunter with few exceptions, the series took place in Hawaii or Dog's home state of Colorado. So basically, it's a reality TV series. And a pretty popular one at that. I mean, I've heard of it multiple times. I've seen a couple of episodes of it. This guy's no small potato. And the fact that they're having him come on there to promote their games is pretty big. Now let's go look at the chart, shall we? All right, guys, so here we are on the chart for VRVR. Now, as you can see, there's not as much volume on it as most of the stocks that I normally promote. Now, note, guys, I am not a stock professional. I'm not a stock advisor. Do your own due diligence. But this stock is on my radar because normally when a company has some big name or some celebrity promoting it, usually it makes that company well known. If an influencer of some sort, like Dog the Bounty Hunter or Dwayne Dog Chapman, is promoting this, that normally attracts a lot of people that for example, might have watched Dog the Bounty Hunter and said, oh, Dwayne's promoting this. I should check it out. Normally, a lot of these companies, what they like to do is they like to have influencers, you know, like celebrities, YouTubers, etc., promote their product. And thus, it, they expose that influencers fan base to their product which is why sponsorships are made things like that so the fact that they have dog the bounty hunter promoting their product is a pretty big deal on october 21st this stock hit a high 
of $3.45. And the volume eventually dropped, and all of a sudden, by November 9th, 2021, it hit a new low of $1.25. The volume went up, and the price remained stagnant for a time, lowered a little bit towards the beginning of December. The volume went back up, started climbing a little bit again, and all of a sudden it just remained stagnant for a time, but I have a feeling, and again, this is my opinion, not a stock professional, not a stock advisor, do your own due diligence, but I have a feeling that this is poised to go up. Already the volume seems to be going up, and it looks like it's poised to keep going. So I think as soon as they have this guy, Dog the Bounty Hunter, Dwayne Dog Chapman, promoting their product, it's going to attract a lot of viewers. It's going to attract a lot of his fan base. And it's not like it's not a small fan base. If you look over here, Dog the Bounty Hunter had nine seasons and 246 episodes and went on for a total of eight years. So it's not like this wasn't popular. And if you look over here, there's spinoffs, multiple spinoffs of this show. Now, if they have a guy like Dog the Bounty Hunter basically promoting their product, I think that this stock will be noticed by more people and not just more regular people, but also by people that trade in stocks or invest in stocks and the volume is already poised to go up. But that's just my opinion, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. If you're new to my channel, definitely be sure to ring that bell icon to stay notified when new videos are uploaded. As far as social medias go, links are in the description down below. I got Facebook, I got Instagram, I got Twitter, I got everything. So that's it for me, guys. I love you. It's Double Nicks, and I'm out. Peace! Bye-bye.